Hillary Clinton went to Miami to maximize the impact of her call to resume trade with Cuba and allow travel there. The Cuba embargo needs to go once and for all. Despite opposition in this biggest of swing states, most U.S. voters support the Clinton position on Cuba, but fewer support her. The new Quinnipiac poll found Clinton slipping to just a tie against Republican Scott Walker and Jeb Bush in head-to-head -head matchups. And Clinton's negative numbers are her worst ever. 57% said Clinton is not caring or trustworthy. Only Donald Trump did worse at 58%. Jeb Bush in Fort Lauderdale said faith in our institutions needs repair. It's up to all of us to work diligently to rebuild that trust. That happens one person at a time, one politician at a time. Donald Trump is still in Scotland, still boasting about his big lead in GOP polls. 20 percent today in Quinnipiac, double Jeb Bush's number. I think we're going to get the Republican nomination. Clinton may hope so. Trump is the only major GOP candidate she does beat today. 48 to 36 in a polling matchup. And ahead for Hillary Clinton is more on her email controversy, which could add to the perception among some voters that she's not truthful. I'm Steve Handelsman, NBC News, Washington.